take if you wave your hat or something to him, yeah. he'll wave back. You never forget it. Because yeah, there's a lot of China shipping, Cisco. If you look at this one right here, China shipping. Wow. Oh yeah. And I found out where they do the loading of right. these things. Down this line where it's going now, uh -huh. way at the other end has a little thing where it can pick up the these and put them on. Oh, no way, really? Oh yeah, they use it. I saw them loading up a train. Uh -huh. okay. And sometimes, if you're lucky, one of these trains will be on this line, going out that way. Uh -huh. That the train has to wait until the railroad clears. <laughs> Runner as a top priority. Yeah. But I feel sorry for Amtrak. Whenever they get to LA, uh -huh. they have to wait on the freight train. They don't get to go really? ahead. They have to wait on the freight train to come through. They don't get priority up there. Because oh, that's the hub. It's Los yeah. Angeles. It's where all the trains start before they come here. Yeah. Before they head out to Texas and on. Have you ever heard of the Fort Worth, Worth and Western? In Texas, what? it's the Fort Worth and Western. It's a train that takes no, the train from the rest, like from this train onwards. Really? Yeah. If you ride the Grapevine Railroad, you can you meet up with the, the train. If you ride the two two four eight Puffy. Ah, really? Yeah, they actually got a four six zero and been running on their line. That used to be long to SP. Oh no way. Yeah. It used to be at the Texas um, State Railroad Museum for a while. And then originally before, they used to do a fire patrol. They used to send the engine out with a tank car with water to spray some fires. Yeah. And after that, went into retirement until the flu time ran out. On the way. And then the Texas State Railroad bought it, restored it, and ran it as their number 200. Wow. Now it's not 2246. It's been numbered three different times. On the way, really? Yeah. So, yeah. 